Good morning. I'm Helen from Georgia, and I'm out here this morning, bright and early. Uh, the sun is just coming up. It's, I think it's about eight o'clock. I, I think. Uh, and it's it's warm a little bit. It's 77 degrees right now, but it's gonna get up to 90 something. That uh, Siri said. I just asked her. <laughs> I'm having my coffee this morning, and I'm having it with this bluebird cup. Isn't that beautiful? And this is y'all's cup. I'm going to let y'all have my Georgia cup. Where does it say it? Right there. Georgia cup. <laughs> so y'all have a sip. I mean, have a, have a little taste of coffee this morning. Okay, I'm going to have a little... A little bit myself. Whoo! It's hot, I'm telling you that. And black, no sugar, just coffee. That's what I drink. Well, Folgers is what I drink, coffee. But they say, they say coffee is going to be and everything else is going to go up sky high. It's already doing it. The uh, shelves are on the, in the stores are getting bare again. Oh, y'all look at my flowers. Cody and his girlfriend brought me these. How pretty. And, and they are, uh, I, I love them. They are so pretty. I wanted to let y'all see them, how pretty that is. Well, is how beautiful these flowers are that they they brought me. How sweet. Thank you, Cody and Dana. <laughs> uh oh, <laughs> the sun is coming out. It's gonna get warmer, y'all. Uh, y'all. <laughs> In my last video, I was I went to town and showed y'all around our little town. And there's a lot more to see than what I had time to show y'all in that uh, video. But it is so pretty up there. And people were amazed at how clean our town is. Uh, they said, where's the trash? <laughs> There's, uh, there's no trash up up in our town and nobody on the street laying around or anything but that it may come to that one day I don't know but it's not right now anyway and and I was gonna tell y'all y'all know the last video I I did not the last y'all know next to the last video was that trip down to Adrian and on that dirt, red dirt road, I encountered a little bear. He looked little, and I guess he was little. He was not a great old big one. But I was looking around and how amazed it was, how swampy it was there, and all kind of water and trees and all kind of stuff, and I I, t I was getting ready to go. I done looked all I could, you know, look. So I was getting ready to go, and I just took my camera and and done this right here. And I said, well, I reckon I'm going to go. And I come around, and I wasn't really looking. I just took my camera and looked that way. When I got home, I saw a bear. I'm telling you, I... If I had a seen that bear, I would have, I think I would have tried to get a better picture of it. But he was coming towards me. He was coming, he was over there and he was standing up and he got down and he was walking towards me. Kind of fast, you know, wasn't running, but he was walking pretty fast. Anyway, I was watching something on YouTube the other night, and they were t 
talking about bears were getting not many of them anymore. Big old bears, big ones. Well, they was out scouting around looking for them, you know, to tag them or do something. I don't, I don't really know what they was gonna do. I think they were gonna tag them and uh, try to keep up with them and see how many they were and all that stuff. But anyway, they tranquilized one and he fell down there asleep. And they went up there and they opened his mouth and they looked at his paws and all kind of stuff. And they done all what they was going to do to him. They didn't hurt him. They just put him to sleep while they could do what they was going to do so they could keep up with him. But anyway, he, he, they stood around out there to to see if he was going to wake up, you know, enough. Well, but he kind of woke up a little bit, and he was still chained or however they had him confined out there after he woke up. That bear jumped up from there and run out there after them. I, I screamed so loud. I scared my own self. <laughs> I'm telling you. That bear just, whoa. I mean, he just lunged out there. And if that chain hadn't have been on him, he would have got them people and killed them, I reckon. Uh, I'm, a, I'm a little bit leery of bears now. But the one I saw wasn't, wasn't no great old big big bear. It, it, they called it a, someone uh, said it, it was a honey bear. And they're, they're not as big as big old bears. But it don't matter if they little or big. They could probably hurt you or kill you if they wanted to. They'd have had to catch me, I imagine, if I had seen him because I didn't. I didn't know he was there. And I didn't. Oh, it scared me after I really got to thinking about how he was doing. He wasn't going away from me. He was coming towards me. I don't know what he was called himself doing that for, but I don't know if he thought I was something to eat or uh, I, I think maybe his mama, the mama bear, come had done come went down in the woods and he was coming behind her. And I I looked in that video. I tried to look to see if I could see anything else moving besides that little bear. Oh, that really was a little scary. Uh, a lot scary, especially after I saw that great old big bear and how he lunged at them people and how loud he was and how big his mouth was. That man, oh, that bear could have swallowed one of them men almost. Could have got his head in, in his mouth anyway. Oh, good gracious. I'm going to be a little more careful when I go to these deep woods <laughs> by myself oh gracious y'all i have some kind of adventures don't i uh, don't even don't even know it i didn't even know that bear was i didn't see him because i was just looking around at all the it looked like the okie swamp and i said something about it did look like it was swampy and water and trees all growing all out in there and next thing I know well they had put some rocks down there on the side of the road around uh, the thing that lets water come through because it looked like it had about washed out and and I was looking at all that how pretty that big old white granite looking rocks marble or whatever that stuff is it's, it was white and they were laying there and they were so pretty and i was looking at it i never dreamed a bear was anywhere around but i'll be looking from now on i mean i'll be looking in my own woods <laughs> i i don't guess there's any around here but they could be i guess that's that's not too far that's about 
22 miles from here where I was. I, I think that's about how far it, far it is from my house to there. But y'all, there's never a dull moment around here. I tell you, it's <laughs> something all the time. Uh, I have. Oh, I see a hummingbird back there. My uh, sunflowers are have bloomed out most of them some around there on the other side I'll, I'll go around there and show y'all a picture there's one around there it's big as a, it's it's this big it's like a dinner plate it's big old big old a sunflower and oh okay y'all this is y'all can't tell but this is a giant sunflower I mean I'm I know you can't tell that it's that big, but it is big as a dinner plate or bigger. Oh, it's so pretty. All right, I guess that's all. I've had a bunch of them right here, but they've all done bloomed out and the rain has, here's one. It's already <laughs> bloomed and gone. All right. Okay, y'all. I wanted to let y'all see my beautiful crepe myrtle. It is so pretty, and it's full of blooms, and they're so red. Uh, watermelon color, I call them. It's not red. It's uh, beautiful, y'all. I wish y'all could see them like I do. I know this camera's not picking up the true colors but that's the best I could do that's a little bit of breeze blowing thank the Lord ain't that awesome oh 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 let me tell y'all our church we had church Sunday our our <laughs> our church was very bare it was like 12 people there that's including the preacher and everybody that came. I took some pictures of the of the church and I put them on Facebook and uh but we're being and our preacher is is a lot better. He he had the COVID. But he wasn't in the hospital and I don't know of anybody that comes to our church that was in the hospital. They had it, but they, I guess it wasn't uh, too bad, you know, a mild case or something. Our our pastor, he, he said he had the shot, and so I don't know if that made his be uh, better or or not. You know, I can't I can't tell. I, I I'm I'm stay I'm wearing my mask, and I'm not going anywhere except in the woods and uh, to the. Uh, post office and places like that I I try I'm trying my best to be safe because uh, there's a lot of people that get it that don't make it I mean they they uh, they get in the hospital and, and they just get worse and worse they can't breathe but anyway on a better note than that <laughs> Let me tell y'all what I'm going to do. I'm going to tell y'all what I'm going to do. I'm going to make a draped flower pot. The way you do that is you mix up your cement uh and don't put any sand any georgia sand in it this time just cement and water and i have an old cloth over here let me get it doesn't have to be anything fancy or anything like that this is 
This is an, is an old blanket, a cotton blanket. It does better if it's cotton. It absorbs the water and the cement better. And I'm going, I'm going to take this old blanket and cut it and drape it and dip it in cement and make a beautiful flower pot. Hopefully, that's what I'm going to do. Let me have another, another little taste of coffee. I'm going to see what I'm going to need. I'm going to move my, my coffee. This is an old flower pot that's just on its last legs. It's brittle and it's, it's going to break and it's, I've already threw it away. <laughs> but I went and dug it back out. Uh, I'm going to put it up here and lay this over and see uh, how long I want my I'm going to raise this up some because it's, it's a I want the draping to be a little further down. Look, look what I found, y'all. <laughs> I found this old thing. It had dirt in it. And let me, I'm not going, I'm not going to do it right here on this table because I don't want to mess this table up. I probably need to go ahead on and move it out of the way. Let me turn the camera off again. I'll be right back. Okay, I've got my cloth draped over here. And I've got two cut. Uh, I'm going to do both of them. So, uh, I'm, I'm going to mix my cement now. And let me get started doing that. Let me get down here to my... Okay, this is my Portland cement, and this is two cups. I'm going to put four cups. Of Portland's, maybe five. Five cups a Portland cement. Now where's my water? Oh, I never... That's all I'm going to put. I'm not going to put any sand. And it's going to be thin because I'm going to dip this this cloth in here and I want it to absorb doesn't take much to get it mixed up. Okay, I'm going to put the, I'm going to put the cloth in here. I'll, I'll dip it in here. I'm going to put my gloves on. I'm 
gonna go ahead and put this other one that's already saturated on here over here okay I move my camera oh good gracious I need Okay, let me get this other one now. Okay, I'm going to start cutting uh, some of these ends down here that's too long. Can y'all see? I'm going to put something else on it uh, besides this kind of stuff. I found this old shirt. And it's got some fringe on it, and I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna cut it off and use it.
nước này quá dài All right, I guess that's the way it's going to stay. Okay, I'm going to turn it off now and go in the house for a while and I turn it around, but I don't have it on a turntable. Okay, let me turn it off while I got my hands pretty clean. But anyway, thank y'all so, so much for being so kind and gracious to me that y'all are. Y'all uh, bless me every day through e uh, comments, and I'm so thankful. Thank y'all so much for being so faithful. <laughs> I know y'all could probably watch something a lot better than this, but this is just me. This is how I am, and and this is a, this is the only way I know how to be. And I I don't I don't try to be something that I'm not because I don't know how. <laughs> it's when you're 83 years old, I guess you're going to be the way you are because it's about too late to try to change now. <laughs> but this is y'all, this is going to be one of a kind. And oh, I'm so thankful. I just thought this up this morning, y'all. I've been trying to figure out uh project I, I've been on the road and I've been here and there and in the woods and uh, everywhere uh, but this is this is my uh, project that I'm that I'm doing right now and I hope y'all like it and thank y'all again so much and and we are so blessed let's pray for everyone that has COVID there's so many now that have it, and uh, some are not making it. I don't know how many. I can't keep up with all that stuff, but anyway, we can pray for them, and the Lord, if it's His will, you know, He'll intervene. And so I'll see y'all in the next in the next part of this video, y'all, in the next part. I'm the... I done got hot and confused and everything, and I stay confused. <laughs> but I'm going to let this dry a while, and I may have to come back and add a little more cement to it. I'll see y'all later. Bye. Good morning. I'm Helen from Georgia, and I'm out here this morning. Y'all, it is hard to do anything in Georgia because it rains every day. And, and it's hazy and foggy and all that right now. And yesterday afternoon, it came the worst thunder and lightning storm. Almost like the other day when it thundered and lightning so bad, so long. But the lights didn't go out yesterday. But y'all, it's hard to do a project when when it's unpredictable the weather is and it's just almost impossible anymore but anyway i have just a little bit of coffee left and and i poured it for me i i hope y'all have some y'all can drink with me y'all come on up closer where y'all can see i'm gonna take this pla i had to put this plastic on here because the rain just came and I had to cover it up so that it's got plastic on it now so I'm I'm gonna take the plastic off and I'm gonna see what how it looks in there <laughs> mm. good coffee y'all y'all know it's black and no sugar just just black so that's the way my mama used to drink coffee I didn't drink coffee way back then, uh, but when I started drinking coffee, 
I tried putting milk and sugar and all that in it, but to me, I didn't really like it. I, I, I guess I got that from my mother because that's how she drank coffee. Just black with no nothing in it, but just black coffee. So that's what I drink. Let me open this. Take this plastic off. Y'all, let me take it off and see what see what we got. Good gracious. I got to take it off of this. Oh. Form that I've got it on. I'm gonna lay that right there. Let's see. Something over my little uh, thing here. It's really hard to do a project when you when you're trying to do something outside. But it could be worse, you know, it could be dry and everything just burning up, but it's not that. Let me let me wipe off this table a little bit. Let me get something. It's 78 degrees, y'all, in, in Georgia. In my town in Georgia. Let me let me take it off. Y'all see, <laughs> Lord have mercy. I want to clean this off a little. I'm going to take it over here and rake it out. Did y'all see the inside? That's the inside of it. Okay, y'all, I'm going I'm going to paint it. Okay, y'all, I'm going to start. Okay, y'all, I'm putting some black paint on it. Hope it don't start raining, y'all. It could, cause it does all kind of stuff.
Oh, <laughs> my camera cut off and I had to store it back up. So I'm going, I've got it painted uh, black. I'm going to uh, be painting on it some with this color. This is something I mixed up. <laughs> red and black and I can't get my turntable to doing right this is not supposed to be a fancy <laughs> flower pot I like sort of old looking things, you know. I know y'all probably don't. May not. I don't know. Let me get over here and turn it around a little more. Y'all, things are not working out as I planned that much I'm trying I can't get my turntable to do right I think it's maybe because I have this plastic bag over it and y'all I'm trying to hurry because I think it's gonna rain it's 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 overcast and it's it could start any time now. Any time. This weather we're having now is just like you don't know what to do. You just try to do uh, something and try your best to get through with it before the rain sets in. Y'all, I did, I don't even think I told y'all. This is acrylic paint. This is a uh, apple barrel red glossy paint. This is what I'm using. And y'all, I, I I really <laughs> don't have that much planned. I just I'm just doing whatever I think it needs it at the time. And that's what that's what I'm doing. That's really uh, what I do. <laughs> I do sort of like Whatever seems like it needs to be at that at that time. I'm not set up too good, and nothing is working right. I'm doing the best I can, y'all. Please bear with me, cause things are not always easy. It's it's a little bit. Uh, trying sometime, but you try to just keep on working with it and trying to get something out of it that you can live with. <laughs> uh, and the circumstances are not great, y'all. Y'all know when you're trying to do something and, and it's overcast and it rains every day and I thought I felt something sounded like a raindrop Amber. I 
hear something. And it, it could start raining any second now. Now I'm putting a little tad, a little tad of yellow on it to sort of brighten it up just a little. I told y'all, I think, I'm putting a little tad of yellow to brighten it up just a little. Y'all, I can tell you one thing. This is one of a kind. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I know there's not another one like this. Okay, y'all. I'm I'm gonna stop because I I got paint from all over, all over me, and I just about can't stop because I keep seeing things that I need to do, but I got to just quit. You know, that's how I am. I I don't know when to quit. Okay, I, I'm going to stop. I'm going to quit looking at it because the more I look at it, the more I want to do to it. Okay, I'm, I got to go in the house and get, get some of this paint off, off of me and I'm going to try to let it dry. Uh... The air is not dry, y'all. The air is damp, and I'm just going to try to let it sit here and, and dry as much as I can, and then I'll come back. I'll be back. Oh, let me tell you. <laughs> I about forget to tell y'all. Thank, thank y'all. Thank y'all for watching this video. Thank y'all for being so kind and caring. It's, it's a blessing to me to have people that really care, that watch my videos, that uh, they inspire me and want, I want to do more of something that y'all will like. And I've tried a little bit of everything. <laughs> I don't know. I've tried road trips, I've tried uh, cement, I've tried uh, stained glass. Uh, thank the Lord that I'm still here and I can still get out here and do. Sometimes they get a little hectic and the weather doesn't help any when it's trying to rain every day and you, you have to do something and let it dry. And it's hard to move it after it gets
put somewhere it's it's hard to move it because it's just me and I and I don't you know I, I have to move it the best I can so I covered it up with some plastic and let it let it dry the best it could I don't think it dried as much as it should have because it's still a little loose but you know that's okay it'll harden up some uh, as it sits and I'm, I'm I wish I could let y'all see the whole thing I reckon I can turn it around anyway I want to thank all my YouTube family thank you so much for watching my videos and subscribing and sharing and clicking the bell and thumbs up and all the sweet things y'all do I appreciate it so much I think it helps me you know when you subscribe and share and stuff uh, I hope y'all like it like my videos and I'm gonna try to keep doing them as long as I can think up something to do <laughs> but it's beautiful and I'm proud of it it's awesome but it'll dry some more after after it sets up it's it's damp out here it's not it's not dry weather it's damp weather and I hope it uh oh it's gonna stay together it just it just is not I don't think it's as dry as it could be because of the dampness in the air all right y'all i'm gonna turn it off and i'll be back when it dries some or, or when the paint dries some and and i'll come back and try to finish up this video <laughs> uh i got to get some paint off of me it's all over it's all over me all right i'm gonna cut it off now i'll see y'all in a little bit bye bye <laughs> y'all Thank y'all so much for watching this video, and I, I'm I'm finished with it. I I I went, I couldn't get it together because it was trying to be cloudy and rainy and everything that I didn't want it to be. But I was trying to get through with it before it rained. And y'all look, the sun has come out. It's about one o'clock in the afternoon, and it doesn't look like rain, but that doesn't mean anything in Georgia. Uh, Georgia, it can rain and the sun will be shining. <laughs> Almost. I, I really... Oh, you know, I start out with something and I don't really and truly know exactly what it's going to be. <laughs> I just go along and, and figure it out as I go. That's what I do. Sometimes I, I I try to think ahead and but sometimes I just uh as I go I just decide stuff and, and and I think this is beautiful, y'all. Look at it. How pretty it is. It ain't level, y'all. I can't get my table and everything level. But anyway, y'all see it. <laughs> Y'all try this if y'all uh, would like to. It doesn't have to be such a big one like I did. I I didn't realize it was going to be that big, really. I, it'll hold a big plant, uh, plant and decorate it the way you you feel like you want to decorate it. And... I want to thank y'all again for watching my videos, subscribing and sharing and clicking the bell and thumbs up and my thumbs and, and my hands has got paint on them. But anyway, thank y'all for doing all the sweet, kind things y'all do for me. I, I'm so blessed and I'm so thankful to have all each and every one of y'all that's in my YouTube family and uh, that's out there. In, uh, YouTube land. I, I, I'd like for y'all to watch my videos, but you know, you can't watch them all. I can't even do that. I try to see 
what everybody's doing and it's it's a big world out there and it's you can get lost in it <laughs> like you can you cannot find whoever you looking for but anyway I'm through with it and I'm thankful that I got through with it y'all that sun is hot today because it's been behind the clouds and it's way up there now and it's coming down right on top of my head <laughs> but this is my video and and I and, and I, I would like for y'all and I know you do I know you do already but I would like to remind somebody that may not think about it older people and some younger people are very down and out and a, a kind word and a hey how are you doing and uh, speak to people that 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 means a lot because some people think they're undeserving to be spoke to maybe in their uh, lifestyle or whatever but always remember there's there that God loves all of us and he wants us all to do good and be good and he'll help us along our way if we let him all right well I'm going to get off now and get out of this this sun is cooking my brain <laughs> wherever it is up there <laughs> oh sometimes I wonder if I even have one up there but anyway I'll see y'all in the next video bye bye <laughs>